Hello, everybody, and welcome. It is another year here at Kroger, and I have with me Shanna Harp, Home Instead Senior Care. And Shanna, it, it, it's just amazing. We were talking off camera a moment ago, but uh, the fun this is, uh, our uh, Santa for a Senior program, but not only picking the names, the shopping, and picking it out, knowing who it's going to, and then that day where we take them to the nursing homes and uh, retirement homes, but uh, it's just an amazing time, isn't it? It's a great time of year. It's it's a good time for them to, to see the joy on their faces and for them to realize that there's somebody out there that, that's thought about them, maybe not necessarily doesn't know know who exactly who they are, but that somebody's taking the time to um, to shop for a gift and, and, and deliver it and, and make sure that, that they have something. Mm -hmm. How many years is this we've been doing this? Ten years. Ten years. That's How a about lot of that? Wow. And this year we got five hundred that we have to buy gifts for. We, we, you know, not me and Shanna. We need <laughs> All your of help. us together. Yeah, we need a lot of help. Now we're buying gifts, and uh, my wife that is watching this right now has the most fun shopping for these gifts. And Shanna, as I look on the tree, things like uh, jogging suits and uh, uh, baskets and uh, pajamas and uh, you know a lot of the women uh, lotions and creams and things that. You know, we really don't think of, but and, and you know, we think of kids for Christmas, but we don't think of people in nursing homes. Yeah, and a lot of times, like you said, blankets and body, things we take for granted that we're able to buy every day that um, aren't necessarily easy for them, accessible, mm -hmm. easy for them to get to. Um, and like I said, we, we take for granted being able to come to Kroger and buy those mm -hmm. things and have them in our homes, and they, they don't have that access, so it's, it's, it's really a gift to them. So sometimes just the essential things, the, a blanket, a jogging suit, yeah. things, things that aren't elaborate, that are easy to buy. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, and it's it's just it's a gift it's yeah. for them. And it's so much fun. And I, I remember back. I can't believe it's been ten years already. But uh, the first year we did it, uh, I'd never really done nothing like this. But to buy those gifts and actually see those people opening those gifts. Uh, and, and I told you before, I, I took my grandson one year and uh, to show him what really the true meaning of Christmas is, because kids are our kids like we were you know I want this I need this I gotta have that but uh, we really don't and when you see people that's less fortunate and and can't get out like you and I can run to the store where we want to go and get that blanket or whatever we want but uh, it, it really is amazing but with 500 gifts to buy uh, we need to go ahead and get started and that's why we're trying to talk to you early tell us the process we've got the tree here we've got the box uh, tell us how this works. All you have to do is come to Kroger, or we have a, trift, a tree at Home Instead, a tree at Mellonmore, and we have a couple of churches that are helping us out. Just take an ornament off the tree, take it with you, buy the gift, return it to this box. Our pickup date is December the 16th, and we'll be checking the box. So that way, if it, if it hopefully gets full fast, and um, when it gets full, we'll we'll transfer the gifts we'll make sure they wrap, they're wrapped if you if you don't have the capacity to wrap them we will wrap them for you and um, and we will also get them delivered so if you could just get them to us at like I said at, at home instead mail them more or right here at Kroger we will get it done for you okay and uh, wrapping them is a great thing we love wrapping ours and, and and putting the card on it and taking them into home instead and home instead if you don't know where it is if you're new to the area it's right across the street from Kroger, uh, in the shopping uh, center, uh, right across the street from Kroger. If you're buying gas at Kroger, while you're buying gas, you can uh, look over there and keep an eye on Billy Frost or Shannon or, who, or whatever they're doing over there. But that's how convenient it is right here on Hillcrest Parkway. And, and you know, growing up here, I, uh, I forget a lot of times how we have grown over yeah. the years and so many people are new to our area and we want you to participate what a great feeling it is you've heard us share these stories but uh come by uh just grab one off and uh and you can even go with us as uh, we go play santa we invite you to come because there's so many gifts to give out right. uh, and to me that is the fun part uh the stories that uh we share from year to year and uh uh, Home Instead Senior Care has reached uh, literally millions. Yes, because this is this is a worldwide. Yes, we have a worldwide. So this is this particular program, Home Instead, everywhere mm -hmm. do this particular program. And it's so, so much fun when we get to be Santa. 
you know, and in this case, you are Santa. You get to be Santa. You get to come from the North Pole. You get to pick the gifts. Right, and if anybody knows of anybody that needs something that we don't necessarily, you're welcome to call us. My number is 275-8176. If you know a senior that needs help that I may not necessarily have had access to their name and their address, then you're welcome to call me anytime and let me know, and I'll, I'll add it to my list. Okay, let's get started. You heard the deadline's December 16th. Let's don't wait because if there's some gifts that, uh, that were not bought, then we have to hustle around and make sure these people are taken care of. So uh, let's say by December 1st or 2nd or 5th or whatever, let's don't wait to the last minute and uh, get those gifts, get them into Homestead Senior Care. And uh, uh, one more time, we have over 500 gifts to buy by December the 16th, right? Yes, sir. And they can call us. You can come by and help us with that. And uh, anything else that we hadn't covered? I don't think so. We've we pretty we're well going. covered it all, haven't we? Yeah. Well, Merry Christmas to everybody. Merry Christmas to you, Merry Shannon. Merry Christmas to you. And thank you so much for talking to us today. And, and second of all, thank you to Home Instead. Uh, this is a wonderful program, and y'all do a great job, not only in this, but uh, one thing about Home Instead, they support all kind of things in our community. And being with the TV station, we get to see those things that Sometimes you don't see, but uh, if you need Home Instead Senior Care, uh, y'all do so many things uh, uh, from uh, picking up medicines and helping people. Uh, I've known some of the uh, employees going and getting videos for them to watch or DVDs. Yes. And uh, uh, there's so many things that Home Instead Senior Care can do. It's not a service where you need, if you don't need somebody every day, maybe you need somebody on Mondays to check on you. Uh, we'll, yeah. we'll do your grocery shopping, we'll, yeah. we'll offer you companionship, we'll take you to the doctor. We, we do all of those things, yeah. so we, 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 we take pride in what we do. We, we feel like we do a great job. We have some very good caregivers, mm -hmm. and, um, and they, get the, they get it done. And people is everything, Shanna. And before we go, brag on the staff, uh, because every time I walk in, you feel that warm feeling when you walk in the office because I don't care who's there, they come in to get the reports or turn in their pay sheets or whatever. Everybody has a smile on their face, but just before we go, brag on the staff some. We have a wonderful staff. Yeah. We really do. <laughs> we, we, I, I, sometimes I feel like we have to do something we have to do more. Mm -hmm. And um, But our staff, of course, isn't necessarily working in the office. They're working in people's That's homes. Right. And so, But I get the, the joy of, of doing their schedules. And so I get to talk to everybody and mm -hmm. keep up with everybody. And um, we have wonderful, wonderful people, kind, caring, compassionate, which Holman says training process is, is geared towards kind, caring, compassionate right. um, development. And it you can really tell the difference in, in a caregiver That's and right. then somebody who's not necessarily, not everybody is a caregiver. That's right. Um, and, and we have, they, they go above and beyond for, for all of our seniors and us. Yes. So um, we're very proud of them, and a lot of them help us with this. Yeah. They, you know, if we get gifts that are unwrapped, they they help, they come in and help us wrap gifts. They help us deliver gifts. They, I have them already calling, saying, when, you know, when when are we delivering? When is the party? When you know, wanting yeah. to know how they can help. And in addition to their jobs and things mm -hmm. they don't get paid for, yeah. they're always there right. and um, and willing to do anything that that I you know that I need them to do. And I'm yeah. really really appreciate that yeah. so. way beyond what they get paid to do there's Correct. no doubt uh, way beyond so uh, it is a great staff uh, billy frost and the staff at home instead a uh, wonderful job and everything you just said I, I think of two words basically but love and compassion and that's what you get because just not anybody goes in your home these uh they go through a very strict i've been there when uh, that process is going on so it's a very strict process right. uh, with background checks and, and and more than that uh you have to fit that that uh mold that uh shanna just shared with us but you got to have that love and compassion well and we take the time to match specific personalities together and mm -hmm. I, i'm in charge of that mm -hmm. so it, when you have somebody you know making sure that they know the client well making sure that they know the caregiver well and then and making sure that their personalities are going to mold and and to be able to flow and if you have somebody every day if you have them once a week that you're that you look forward to seeing yes. them and that that they can be a part of their lives and, and continue their their lifestyle at home. Yeah. What's the most fun about your job? Oh, let's see. Probably dealing with my, my caregivers. Mm -hmm. 
just doing things for my caregivers is, is the most fun. I get the most gratification from that and, and knowing that if a senior needs us, that that I can be there and that I can facilitate that. that that's the that's the blessing that comes from my job. Yeah, well. So some some of the ins and outs of scheduling and that kind of stuff can be kind of hard, but other yeah. but the and this program have, is is a lot of fun. Yeah. I actually get to get out and, <laughs> and talk to people and do stuff instead of sitting at my desk and um, so that's that's fun too. Well, thank you for talking with me today. You're welcome. Okay, and we really appreciate you joining us today. Get out and support this Santa for a senior. The trees here at Kroger, the trees at Mellon Moore, some of the churches are hipping out, and also the tree at home instead. Please get out and support this. Merry Christmas.